Good afternoon and do welcome to the live telecast of match number 79 of Hero I League 2022 and 23. This is the Rajiv Gandhi Stadium in Aizol hosting this match between Aizol FC and Mohammedan Sporting. Aizol FC at the moment uh, are at uh, number 8 with 17 points and uh, Mohammedan Sporting to win this match is what uh, the coach has to say and this is his team almost the same except uh, that uh, Veron uh, will be waiting. A lot of changes once again. Uh, Zotan Maya is back in goal. One of the persons uh, missing from this first 11, of course, is uh, Marcus Joseph, the man who already scored seven goals in this uh, season of I-League. The man who was the highest scorer in the last season of I-League uh, is not in the first 11. He will be in the reserve bench and wait for his chance to come in. And they are all ready as well, the referees and uh, the assistant referees as uh, Kim Kima, the captain of the Isol FC team, coming in for the toss. Uh, he's along uh, with his uh, counterpart, Osmane, both are central defenders. So Isol FC having a good uh, track record at home. And here we go, the start of the match. This is the Isol coach. Uh, Brings out uh, the talents from young people. Kiseka, referee, doesn't take time to blow his whistle. Look at that. Can uh, Aizol score from here? That was uh, a threatening ball. And uh, Akito Saito was going for that ball. A card will also be flaunted. And the card will be shown to Ram Sangha. So the first card, this is Ram Sangha, the man who has been booked by the referee. So no goal has been scored in the first half. As a referee blows his whistle for half time. Here is the half time score. Aizol FC nil, Mohammedan Sporting nil. And here we go. The second half resumes and Mohammed Sporting playing from the left to right of your screen. Mohammed Sporting coach Kibu Vikuna. And he finds Ram Sangha as well. Mawaya. And uh, that will be a free kick. That's a foul. We want to see end to end stuff. Meanwhile, Mudzayev here. This is Ken Lewis. Will he take a shot? Yes, it does. And and that was a hit to the park post. My goodness me. What a good opportunity. What a lovely shot. And he hits the post. Bad luck for Mohamedan Sporting. No, that was a, a short one to Milan Mudzayev. But this was. Uh, Oh dear, and they're claiming for a goal. They're claiming that the ball crossed the goal line. This is interesting. Nothing can be done now, but uh, it was so close. If you can have a look at it too, once again. So, an interesting situation there. And the keeper was uh, unable to judge the flight. Meanwhile, and uh, this is how the score reads still. Aizol FC nil, Mohammedan Sporting nil. Christy Davis loses out. Mafela hitting six shots. Kiseka not having the best of outings today. Henry Kiseka, the man who scored five goals for his team. Mawaya. Tarpuya. Can he beat Mandi there? Tarpuya still holding on. And he was uh, kept waiting for quite long. Meanwhile, uh, this is silo. This can be dangerous. And that's a penalty. So, referee indicating to the spot. And that will be a penalty in favour of Aizol FC. The moment the sporting players can't believe it. The referee says uh, nothing doing. So, that was uh, a foul and a penalty has been awarded. It's uh, Henry Kiseka. With the penalty and he scores. I saw FC 1, Mohamed Sporting nil. Henry Kiseka scores his sixth goal of the season. And the spectators are happy. And why not? The home team has scored. 
in the 68th minute of the match. So the spectators uh, waited for Henrik Iseka. That was uh, Adinga, in fact, and uh, this is uh, Silo. And this can be dangerous. This is another shot from Viran. Silo to Tharpuya. And that was uh, not a very good defending there. Will he take a shot? Well done, Faisal, from there. Marcus Joseph inside the penalty box. Can he turn? And that's a shot rather weak. There was a deflection, is it? Yes, there was a deflection as well. That was Marcus Joseph. Deflection. Fazlu Rahman with a cross. This can be dangerous. Oh dear, that was so close. Now see that. That was the cross. And the keeper. He finds Mundi. Nicola. Nicola with a shot. And the woodwork denying Mohammed and Sporting. Nicola is upset. Bad luck for the black and white brigade. So it's all happening. And this is Osmane. But that's all over for Mohammed and Sporting. It's the final whistle and Aizal FC win and this is the hero of the match, Amawaya. And this is the final score then, Aizal FC 1, Mohamedan Sporting 0.